What's up guys? So in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys all of my old Scratch projects. Now, as you can see right here, this is my profile. I joined six years ago in 2017. Now, uh, I'm not going to tell you guys how old I am, but that was quite a while ago. And so we're going to go through all my projects and so you guys can see what six years looks like on Scratch. Um, this game was sort of like a, uh, I don't know how to describe it. It's a, it's a choose your own story game. It's not mobile friendly and... Uh, I kind of gave up on it, but it was really cool. And uh, there's a lot of these lab bees. There's, um, I made multiple of them. All right, guys, the game just loaded and uh, we're gonna start playing it. So we have Wixter Presents. That's my name on Scratch. Uh, made it six years ago. <laughs> Can't find a way to change it. Now, I don't quite remember the story for this game, um, but that's something we'll go through together. Alright guys, it just loaded. Um, this is the main menu. Oh, it actually looks kind of good. Except for that right there. Um, it just loaded. Uh, let's see. Settings. Uh, uh, we'll turn FPS on. Volume all the way down. Alright, let's play. Let's see what this looks like. Hopefully, it's actually something nice. Uh, really hope. Okay. Okay, smooth little animation. That is not smooth at all. <laughs> How do we get in? Oh, okay, so now we actually get to move. Uh, A and D. Okay, cool little character. Space to interact. What could have made that? Okay. Oh, did not mean to press that. Okay, let's keep going. Okay, so we actually get to put our hands down. Pretty cool. So far, so good. Now, a lot of my games, if I remember correctly, they weren't finished, and I I don't know if this is one of them. Um, it's back here. Oh, the button mashing section. And we get to look around while we do it. It's gonna take a while. Oh, why is it taking so Okay. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I guess the game wasn't finished. <laughs> three nights at tubs or, or one night at tubs if uh so let's look at the comments oh they're all broken um let's see wow um this is not that good only two characters Oh. Hello, hello. I believe it was just a menu. Oh, events. Okay. Voice actors. Oh. Okay, cool little intro. Wow. Okay, so I guess I'm like a main menu expert, but I am not a game expert. Game changes based off the stories you make, your choices change the game. Okay, would you guys like to see a series on how to make one of these interactive story games? Because if you would, if you would, let me know and I will make one for you guys. Don't play this. I actually did remake this one and uh, I, if I believe correctly, I did make this game on Game Maker. If you guys would like to see that, let me know and I'll show you guys in the future. But, this is a little cafe critic. Uh, that's not copyrighted music. I remember I had my friend make that for me. So, we have hats. Don't know how to change them. See, this is very old. I'm trying to press all the buttons to figure out which one changes the hat, because I don't want that hat. J. Okay, anyway. So, I remember I had a build system in here, so you can build. Like such. Perfect. And then, if you go up to the computer... You can buy tables and you can open and close the store. Now, I, th I do believe customers would actually walk in and you would have to help them. But um, yeah, so this game does not look good at all. Uh, use the variables for the names and um, the system is kind of bugged. So uh, let's, you know what? Let's interact with the customer. Oh, finally, one came in. Let's see game is okay we have to click them let's see oh and there's two in there uh coffee they want coffee right there 
And it just uses the, the, the bubbles. Ooh, um, so that means he wants water. Wow. Yeah, this game is not good, guys. And uh, let's look at the upgrades. It's only table upgrades. You can't upgrade how many people come in. Yeah, that, that sucks. So this is really going to show off uh, my improvement. So this was made in 2021. Now I made a new one. So this is the same one. But I just changed it up. You can hear the same music in the background. This one was made... 2021. Okay, so that other one must have been made all the way back in 2020. There we go. Customizable and pickable characters. Okay. Welcome to the tutorial. Oh, there's a tutorial. Go to the stove. Press E. Water. Customer. Give him the water. Ooh, and it doesn't use the text-to-speech bubbles. So this actually really... This this one, I believe, shows the, uh, the jump from six years to... Or, yeah, the jump of six years. Like, to sh this shows how much you can improve in six years. Now, let's see. Oh, there's a shop. You can get table upgrades, advertisements, size, and tips. If you, want to if you want me to show you guys how to make a game like this, let me know and I will show you guys. You can build and you can rotate the tables, which is a feature that did not take me too long to find out, but it was actually really rewarding. And there's a day system and there's a money system. And it actually shows what the characters are. Oops, that's a bug shows what drink they want which is awesome so yeah guys now what this one was going to be was this was going to be multiple games inside of one as you can tell from the variable still in the top left see i stopped working on this one because i actually uh this is around the time when i quit scratch this is around the time when i quit scratch and i quit youtube and so i stopped it and what this game was going to have is it was just, it was going to have its own uh game so people would have a census to play it but then you can scroll through these working um, like arcade machines and you can play your own uh, game. So like you have Tubbs Arcade 2 and then you have Tubbs Arcade 2 Reimagined. So that one would be um, like with the better and more unique stuff. And the background is just placeholders. And then you have right here Tubbs Arcade Kinfolk, which is uh, arguably my best one. And so yeah, but unfortunately I never got around and I quit the game. Okay guys, this is the next one, Lab B. Now this is the better one, as you can tell from the title. This is the good one. Now I believe this one did have one episode done. Okay, settings, music, tips, subtitles. I doubt if those work, but we'll keep those on. My choices, okay, so there was actually choices. Then we're gonna go to chapters. See, and now there was, there was actually chapters in this game. Surviving, not living, rock at a hard place, and the shadows come alive. Now we're going to start chapter one. Oh, a cool little menu screen. Uh, these don't actually do anything in Scratch unless your project is really big. This game, oh, I didn't even get to read it. Okay, go check on Anom Anomaly B, yes sir. Okay, so we have, we actually have cutscenes. Um, but they're very stagnant. Now I believe this one was actually recent. This was also before I quit Scratch. Uh, I'll choose something to say. The, uh, you know what? The views are worth it. I know this is dangerous, but the views are worth it. Now his response actually does change based on how he, uh, how you res uh, re respond to him. Like all four of those have different answers, but he, I think he always does say, uh, anyway, I hope this place is safe. Cool little getting out of the car. Okay, now I, I actually believe we get to, uh, to uh, move here. Perfect. Get to look at the trees. Our friend was named Milo. What's up Milo? So you should probably head to the right. Yeah, I didn't really know what to put right here. But remember, once again, guys, if you want to see how to make a game like this, let me know and I will show you guys. And I'm I'm try to make the tutorial as best as I can to where you can actually do, honestly, whatever you want. You'll just have all the systems you need. Uh, once again, you can talk to him. I'm going to head to the right, though. Oh, cool little. Okay. Another intro or entrance. 
place isn't what I expected. It's very boring. Boring. Not boring. Why'd you say that? We just got in. Well, we should turn the lights on. Are you dumb? This place is abandoned. He's very rude to his friend. Okay. Go left or right? I am gonna go left. Now, the next episode does change based on your uh, your reply. And then we have this long title screen or credits. <laughs> now our choices, we went left. Now if we go to chapters, play chapter two, which is unlocked, we actually, I, if I am correct, we get a different intro. Dude, this place is scary. I know, right? I have no idea where we're going. I'm going to try to find a way back. Stay here so I can find you. Okay. Okay, good luck, Axel. So his name is Axel. Light, that's the light flickering. Oh, and now we're back to these guys. So that was Axel that we saw. Um, let's stay quiet. Oh, and there's Axel. And I believe that is the ending for this one. Yep. Okay, guys, this is just an, um, I'm running it back. So, if we press, I know you're right, it's gonna be something different. But he is also gonna reply different. Wait a minute. Oh, sorry, guys. Oh, he actually doesn't say, anyway, I hope it's safe. Oh. Oh, <laughs> yes, he does. <laughs> Guess I was right in the first place. Okay, and then we get this cool intro, and I'll cut back once we get to the left or right decision. Alright guys, so now we're back to our left or right decision, and we're actually going to go right this time. And remember, when we went left, the next episode showed us the Axel guy. Now here, we're going to go down this hall. I don't know, but this place looks nasty. What the? And then we get cut off. Now, I'm going to show you guys what the next chapter looks like. Alright guys, so now we're loading into the second chapter, or second episode, and let's see what it looks like now. So it's just saying to evacuate. And the guy is free. Or Anomaly B is free. So it seems if we go right, we get more exposition on the past. But if we go left, we find out there's a monster in the halls. Alright guys, so that's been this video. If you want to see any tutorials for any of these games, leave a timestamp, leave a game title, and then just leave a, I'd like a tutorial on this, please. And I will show you guys. If you guys want an interactive game tutorial, let me know. And I know I haven't made a full one, but I certainly can. So let me know and I will make you guys a tutorial. Um, anyway, that has been this video, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next one.